The 70s would see three Knoll academics win gold medals at the Calumet Region Science Fair and the baseball team capture four straight sectional titles. The wrestling team won sectionals in 1976 and 79, and the 1977 girls swimming medley relay team captured a state championship. But what garnered the most headlines was the boys' basketball team of the mid-70s and its unique style of play. Inspired by a workshop led by North Carolina coach Dean Smith, Warriors coach Bob Bradkey developed a game strategy tailored to his complement of players. We had a group of small guys. Other teams had a lot of big guys. The only way we can possibly win is by getting them out of their zone defense. They had a uh, strategy to slow the game down. They, were, they had a stall game. We created the stall which similar to Milan in the state of Indiana. Kind of a deliberate offense, right? Some people called it the slowdown. The key components to this was that we, he had a wizard of a ball handler by the name of Tom Ispis. Tom Ispis was kind of like the spark plug of that team. He could uh, dribble around anybody. Impossible to guard. A couple teams had to substitute this guy and that guy because the other guy was tired. Well, Tommy Ispis never got tired. <laughs> All I had to do was run around and get open, and he would find me. Tom was the glue, if you will, and we all uh, kind of ran to his tune. Even though the scoreboard posted some low numbers, excitement was strong and the hopes were high. You just did not want to miss a game. It wasn't unusual to have final scores of our games, 10 to 8. The scores were so low, there was a 4 to 2 halftime game, I remember, when they played Clark. My assistant coach, Ray Zawada, at halftime said, I'll take a two-point lead over a team rated in the state any time. That got our players going, and we just had a tremendous season. We ended up winning the sectional, ended up winning the regional, made it to semi-state, and that was a huge deal back then. One of the great things about that team, they didn't go to the game to uh, get their 10 or 15 or 20 points, they went there to win. And that was a great tribute to those players and their parents to go along with, we're gonna go to win. <laughs>